Prepping your sand, it needs to be moist, just not wet. If it's wet, your stuff will never set up. And if it's too dry, it won't stay where it's supposed to stay. Just moist. Okay, so I got my gar set up in the sand. You know, I got a few keys about half inch to an inch deep. The sand is coming about midway. You don't need to be exact. Cover the fins. Don't really need to do much. Leave some dirt on them. You know, there's nothing going to stick to dirt. So it's okay. What I'm mixing here is a, a mix some... R19 to R60 insulation with some plaster of Paris and I mixed it 50-50 it's my own mix it sets fast if you want to slow it down you can just add a little borax all right let me mix this and pour the plaster and then we'll flip it over and do the other side okay I poured the first side of my cast now what I want to do is push it from the edge towards the middle because we really don't need any of this on the edge just a little bit but we need it more in the middle to give it strength you could even push the sand towards it get it more towards the middle okay we'll give this about 30 35 minutes to dry flip it over and do the other side okay i got it flipped over getting ready to pour the back side if you notice i've already cut it you know because i think it's easier to cut when it's frozen you just turn the blade around backwards on your skill saw you notice i got it it's kind of hard to see but it's just the edge of the plaster on just the edge it doesn't have to be perfect you know and uh, we don't need any wax or mold release because nothing's going to stick to all this dirt all right let me pour the other side okay i'll put my cast together sealed it with the same stuff that i used to make the cast with and then i poured foam inside of it it's a one-time use only cast but everything lined up came together nicely now I've got me a good body I'm gonna take the skin out and start tanning it and getting ready to mount okay so I put the skin on the gar all attached ahead tomorrow these things are kind of unforgiving you got to get the body just right show you my seam back here see how it all comes together body fits nicely much easier when you have the cast to go by much easier i'll attach the head on let it dry okay i foamed in the head you see i still got some trimming up to do but now it's sturdy it's on there ain't never gonna come off next thing i'm gonna do is i'm gonna put the back of the throat in and you can see i made a fiberglass tongue i'm gonna set that in and rebuild the throat area okay it's almost done show you it's kind of hard to see with the lighting you know I'm new to all this camera but that be him 